Hi, my name is Kevin O'Hearn. I'm a professor of biochemistry and biophysics at Oregon State University. I have a lot of experience in the world of publishing. I've written and edited hundreds of scientific articles, I've published books, and um, I know a lot about the world of publishing. The story that I have here today, though, has nothing to do with my experience as a scientist or as a biochemist. I was raised in a tiny farm town in the Midwest called Fowler, Illinois. And in 2006, I got wind of plans of people living in Fowler, Illinois, to have an event in 2007 to commemorate the 150th anniversary of the founding of the town in 1857. I had long been interested in the history of the town. Um, I'd worked with my grandmother and several other people in the town collecting uh, interesting information and relevant uh, stories and uh, data uh, about the history of the town. And I thought it would be appropriate for me to finally sit down and write the history of Fowler, Illinois in preparation for this event. And so I did that. Upon completion of the book, um, I realized, however, that uh, this was the kind of book that was very unlikely that any traditional publisher was going to be interested in. First of all, the target audience, uh, which were uh, at that, that time that I thought mostly uh, people who lived in Fowler, Illinois, was entirely too small. Fowler, Illinois, at its biggest, uh, had about two or has about 200 people um, who live there. A lot of people would look at Fowler, Illinois, or the book that I had written, and say, well, it doesn't matter, or who cares? Um, but I cared, and the 200 people who live in Fowler, Illinois, um, all cared. And so um, I looked for ways that I could put my book together to distribute it and have something to give to people that, that would be meaningful for them, and that would record the history that I had, in fact, myself uh, been tracking. Lulu turned out to be an absolutely uh, perfect match for the things uh, that I wanted. First of all, Lulu didn't care about how big or how small my audience was. Um, I was able to take my book, which uh, I have here. It's entitled From Rails to Roads, The Story of Fowler, Illinois. And I was able to publish uh, the book through Lulu and take it back to the town for the celebration in 2007 uh, at the anniversary. Much as I had suspected, uh, the book uh, did not become a national bestseller. Um, and, um, but it was a bestseller in Fowler, Illinois. Um, virtually every person in the town purchased a copy of the book. And I distributed copies of the book to local libraries so they would also have copies of them that would live on uh, long after uh, probably I'm gone and others uh, who have copies of their books are gone as well. My story with Lulu, uh, I'm sure, has been duplicated thousands of times by thousands of other people around the world who have been sort of squeezed out of being able to tell their stories or their town stories, as in my case, uh, uh, in a traditional publishing environment. The hands-on experiences that Lulu uh, gives to people empowers them to tell their stories, and I was very, very happy to have uh, that experience. I want to say thank you to Lulu for making this possible, not only for me, but for all the other people um, who had uh, similar experiences and uh, allowing um, our stories to be told. So thank you, Lulu. You make a quality product, and um, I'm very happy to have had the opportunity to tell this story. Thank you very much.